All right, here we are for another arena draft. That paladin deck did not go anywhere near as well as I thought it would. Should we try it again? Maybe go with the uh, no good old standard mage, shaman maybe. Hmm. I never seem to do well with shaman. I don't know. Maybe I'm just not good with overloads. I think we'll go mage. Alright, what do we get? Um, Violet Teacher's pretty darn solid. Tally Drake's good, but I don't think I'll get the chance to take advantage of it. Um, Fairy Dragon, really good. Mono Worm. Mono Worm can be pretty good. I mean, it's a good one cost, and it gets stronger. It dies almost immediately to two cost minions, though. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll take it. I gotta have a flame strike. I'm gonna take that because I don't have one yet. Um, Direwolf Alpha is pretty strong. Yep. Yeah. Arcane Missiles, Festery Ghoul, Lord of the Arena. Generally, I don't really like any of these cards. Um. I think I'll take Flesh Eating Ghoul because I don't have any threes. It's a substandard three mana card because it's only a two three. But I think it's better than taking Arcane Missiles here. Uh, Frost Nova, Silverhand Knight, really good. Frost Nova can be good, but let's let's lock in the the truly solid cards. Uh, Mad Bombers, pretty good. Zombie Chow, awesome. Azure Drake. Hmm, I don't think I have room for an Undertaker. War Golem is a very kind of big standard card. Nothing special about him. Um, yeah, I guess I'll take the War Golem. It's a little expensive, but... Eh, water elemental super good. It's like one of the best freaking cards. I haven't picked any secrets yet, but I'm kind of tempted to take Mad Scientist. Because I really want like six twos or so. And that makes taking secrets a little bit more useful. Gurubashi Berserker is pretty good though. Cult Master is nice for draw because I've got the Violet Teacher, but I haven't really picked any spells yet, except for Flame Strike. Um, Alright, I'm taking Mad Scientist. I don't... Unstable Ghoul is a good card for a 2. It hurts your own cards, granted, but it usually kills the 3-2 minions pretty easily. At least one of them. Silvermoon Guardian, 4 mana for a 3-3. Three, three. He's okay. Average. I guess I could use some more 4s. I'll take him. Arcane Intellect or Water Elemental. Oh man, Water Elemental is so good. Hmm, not a big fan of Nightblade, and Mirror Image is not exactly amazing. Although I do have a direwolf alpha. Um, yeah, I guess I'll take mirror image here. Frostbolt or polymorph? I think polymorph's more important. The uh, arena games tend to last pretty long, and you've got to be able to deal with big creatures and legendaries. Um, Torn Warrior is not a great 3-drop. Stormwind Knight is actually kind of decent, because he's got a lot of health, mostly. He can rush in, finish something off, and usually still stay on the field. Not a big fan of this set of picks, though. Getting a bit too heavy on 4s. I don't have any secrets, but I think the Kirin Mage is probably best here just because he's 3 mana 
Four three isn't great. He dies to two mana cards, but the Ethereal Arcanist is about useless at the moment, and I'm not really sure I want Blizzard. Maybe I should take Blizzard. I haven't picked a whole lot of high-end cards yet. Another Azure Drake is nice. Wailing Soul is not great. Another Water Elemental? Am I gonna seriously take three Water Elementals? I think I am. Wolf Rider! I think I'll take that Wolf Rider. Yeah. Another Wolf Rider or a Fireball or a Harvest Golem. <sighs> Fireball's a good card. Don't get me wrong. It can win you a game. But it's only ever going to kill one creature. Or make you spend two cards to kill a creature. I think Harvest Golem's probably better here. I need more threes. He's a good, strong card. Ah, now I have an option for a secret. For my mad scientist, what would be better? Probably Mirror Entity. Duplicate's not great. I mean, it's not bad either. But I think Mirror Entity is a, a better counter kind of card. They play it, you get a copy of it, they kill each other next turn. It's not too bad. Um, hmm, Dire Wolf, Kona Cold, South Sea Deckhand. I have a lot of four drops already. I guess I could use another Dire Wolf Alpha. My early game is a little light. Arcane Explosion, Jungle Panther. Jungle Panther's pretty good. I'm taking him. A second Flame Strike. Man, my late game is really weak right now. I could really use some more better cards. I think I'm gonna take the second Flame Strike. Uh, probably Arcane Intellect here. Frostbolt's really good, but I don't have any other card draw in the whole deck. I'd have to play real slow. And I think this could save my butt. Another Mad Bomber? Spiteful Smith is actually a pretty good card. And my late game, like, doesn't exist. He's gonna sit on the field for a while, because he's got 6 HP. It's like a slightly stronger Water Elemental. He's not going to benefit me, really, but I don't need the 2-drop, so... My last card is also fairly weak. Questing Adventurer, Mind Control Tech, Curator Mage. Um, I don't have a whole lot of cheap cards, so I don't think the Questing Adventurer is going to be an easy play. Like, it's not going to grow that fast. I think Mind Control Tech is the way to go, because I think I am going to get overwhelmed in the end game. My end game is really weak. Hopefully I can take a big card. I am not super confident about this deck. We got a little late game AoE. We got a Mind Control Tech. Um, we've got some solid cards, but none of them really work very well together. So. We'll just have to wait and see how it goes. I'll see you in the first game. Bye-bye.